These are X Pro Mini Jeeps. Oh! 37.8. You can fit two grown adults in them. You can fit one and a half grown adults in them. <laughs> and we are gonna modify them and take them to Moab and go up Hell's Revenge and have Rory recover our dead bodies. <laughs> So what I've got here is an X-Pro mini Jeep, which I got from Amazon for about two grand delivered. It comes in a cage, it's all crazy and whatever. So then once I got this thing, I saw this uh, YouTube series from C90 Adventures, which was amazing. His mini Jeep is a little different than this one. It looked fancier, had a front engine, tank was in the back. Ours is 125cc engine in the back. After seeing uh, what C90 Adventures did and getting one of these things, we were like, we need three of these. And what we're gonna do with them is bring them up to a level that we're comfortable doing Hell's Revenge. So you guys are joining us a little bit into the process. So far, we've been working at our houses on these because we didn't have the shop. We now have a shop, thanks to C90 Adventures. He was talking about his overheating, so I have put a fan in mine, because I'm so fat. I have replaced the battery, and then I have added horns, speakers, sound. It's now got coilovers with reservoirs in the rear, regular coilovers in the front. It's got a giant car battery, we've got lights, a winch. I'm basically trying to create a mini version of Curious George. So I've actually gone out and begged and pleaded Robbie Layton to paint it to match Curious George. Robbie did that for me. It is back here in this beautiful red color match to my big Jeep and a lot of zip ties. So far on mine, I rattle canned it gray. This Jeep came in blue. Tucker wasn't having it. And then we upgraded the tire size. We just went to a bigger tire. So I still I still have a lot of work to do on mine. They also come with some stickers that are like an old Willie's Jeep. So George ordered me a green one, but it's more of a forest green and I wanted it more military. So I took it home and as I was thinking, I'm like old Willie's Jeep have a spot for an ax and a shovel. So I cut mine up made some little notches to put some axes and shovels in. I'm gonna paint it a military flat forest green. I've got a few things I need to do to finish it at home and then I'm gonna bring it down and we'll have the whole group together. Okay, so today what we're gonna try and do with mine is uh, get the beautiful Robbie Layton painted body back on it, which means finishing up with these lights that Harbor Freight got us, finishing up wiring the winch that Harbor Freight sent us, and then just buttoning it up. I'm gonna get the suspension swapped out. We're going from a 10 inch coilover to these 12 inch coilovers with the reservoirs because when I sit on this, she rubs. <laughs> That's a personal problem, but we're gonna fix it with these bigger coilovers. So, so far what I've done is wired up the fan, so I will not overheat. Wired up the lights, and our Harbor Freight lights, yay! Then we've got some stuff back there where we've got to do some welding because unfortunately with the lift kit, it's hitting the, what is it hitting, Trevor? The needle valve on the carburetor. It is hitting the needle valve on the carburetor. So we're gonna cut here, cut here and here, and move this back about an inch. That is way bigger. Here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna squeeze. Okay. okay. I'm about to ruin another hat. Well, rear shots are on. Red? Whoa! Wow! That's much better. You're gonna be level when you do the fronts. Oh, you're not. Well, I'm not gonna rub at all. Come get in here with me. Saddle up, park, I'm going shopping. You're still clear. Woo! -hoo! <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing.
Looks like we have clearance clearance. We don't even need to weld anything into there. But we should. I'm thinking this is what we'll do. Keep away from small children. So you can't touch them. Look level? Oh, dang, yeah. that's perfect. Okay. Survey says. Pretty darn good. You're gonna eat up everything at the mall. That looks perfect. Awesome. Well, that's exciting. So it'll be <laughs> it'll be interesting to see factory versus compared to these. Yeah, you're not doing anything, right? As far as suspension, no. So we'll have stock, little upgrades, and then whatever you want to call this. This. <laughs> The only thing that matters on this one was the overheating thing. Everything else, totally unnecessary. So I'm wondering if I have the same problem George has, which is what he's currently fixing right now. We we pick up on it. Yeah. Ow! Oh, yeah. sorry. Yeah, it definitely touches. Uh. That ain't going nowhere. Nice oh. welding, George. It's not my welding, it's the welder. We're getting awfully close to doing what I didn't want to do, Trevor. Could have just taken the body off. Okay, you can see the pretty blue color it was. All right, you can leave your comments below, which is better. Royal blue or rattle can gray? Look at, look at the plastic that you left on there. <laughs> can you look at that? Oh, we still can't get to it. <laughs> oh. It's ooh, ee, yeah. ooh, ee. Well, let's park this and let's get your body back on. All right. It's our new art. <laughs> That's how we're going to store them. commercial for a Badlands win. <laughs> so we got the body on, that was part one. I don't know if we accomplished as much as we wanted to, but we're definitely 
heading in the right direction. So our goals accomplished, but new things were discovered that we've got to work on. Well, that's for another video, so we'll see you next time.